now available on Tata Sky channel number 526. Welcome back. You're watching the Home Buyer's Guide with me, Suesha Savant. This is your armchair guide to some of the hottest properties in the market today, all handpicked by me. Before the break, we took you on a tour of Nahar Amrit Shakti in Chandwali in Mumbai. Let's explore the second project that I have chosen for you, Raheja Rivanta at Gurgaon. Now, before I tell you about the project, let me first tell you more about the location. The national capital region is a hotbed of economic activity. India's largest urban agglomeration stretches over three states, with spanking new business districts, IT and banking hubs, and new corridors of growth. NCR has slowly become one of the most sought-after regions in terms of real estate. Sprawling from Gurgaon on one end to Greater Noida on the other, the national capital region houses everything from beautiful heritage buildings to some of the most impressive mega structures in both residential and commercial segments. It's no wonder. then that the national capital region is also a hot bed of construction activity following the much in demand gurgaon region several other areas are slowly gaining traction here too which are these areas the sona manisar and dwarka expressway to name a few but today i'm going to show you a new project by raheja developers called raheja rivanta which is touted to be the tallest residential structure in gurgaon Gurgaon is the second largest city of Haryana. It is the industrial and financial center of the state. Located 30 kilometers south of Delhi, it is a part of the national capital region. Gurgaon is considered as one of the best cities to work and live in in India. Over the last two decades, Gurgaon has made rapid strides into becoming one of the most sought-after metropolitan cities in India. With young and tech-savvy inhabitants, Gurgaon has emerged as the lifestyle city for arts, entertainment, business, fashion, shopping. fine dining nightlife and hospitality over the years it has also become a major hub for telecom and real estate companies gurgaon also has the third highest number of malls in india gurgaon also has a number of ultra modern hospitals with the latest world class facilities the city also boasts of many five star hotels like crown plaza hotel trident leela kempinski westin courtyard hotel etc it has also emerged as one of the most prominent outsourcing centers in the world In fact, Rivanta in Gurgaon is located off NH8 near the intersection of Northern Periphery Road, Southern Periphery Road and NH8. It is close to the proposed metro line and is 20 to 25 minutes away from the IGI airport. Before we proceed further, let me quickly tell you about the builder's background. Raheja Developers was incorporated in the year 1990 by Naveen Raheja, a first-generation entrepreneur. Today, the company enjoys a strong presence in the NCR and has made its position as one of the largest companies in the real estate industry. The company is one of the fastest-growing entities in the real estate sector, with high customer satisfaction index and high standards of welfare of society and the environment. It is also one of the biggest companies in India with projects spanning over 60 million square feet in hand. Multiple projects spanning over 1000 acres of land at various stages of deliberations are also underway. The company so far developed 36 million square feet of space, mainly residential and commercial projects including farmhouses, plot and development and hotel properties. The company is managed by highly qualified professionals who work hard to ensure that the company maintains its high standards in quality construction, timely delivery and customer satisfaction. The company strives hard to keep its commitments and has a good reputation within the construction industry.
Spread over 18.39 acres in the heart of Gurgaon at sector 78 lies Ravanta Royalty. It gives you two residential options, high-rise Surya Tower and low-rise Tapas townhouses in sizes of 2, 3, 4 and 5 BHK condominiums and penthouses. A place where style meets class and intelligence, happiness and beauty is its very essence. It will have the highest sky bridge in India with world-class amenities for its residents. With this project, the developer aims to offer luxurious apartments at affordable rates given the kind of lifestyle it provides. The covering area for this housing project starts from 1198 to 4961 square feet and its possession is due by 2017. World-class facilities and luxurious homes on offer. So how much will a condominium or penthouse here cost you? Well, the average price per square foot ranges between 5,890 to 9,242 rupees. So some basic calculations will tell you that homes here will cost you anywhere between 96.1 lakh rupees to 3.72 crore rupees. Prices equal grander amenities, right? Let's see. The project offers an infinity pool on the top of the building. This will leave you with the feeling of swimming amidst the clouds. The clubhouse is on the 46th floor and it has all the elements which will make you feel like it's the ultimate destination of luxurious wellness. The design of the project has also been planned in a way that it offers both wellness and functionality. Wellness packed with luxury is the key mantra here. Alright, so we are done with two of the three projects that I handpicked for you. It's time now for another short break here on Magic Bricks Now, India's first property channel. But don't go anywhere. When I get back, we'll explore M1 Aureus by M1 Homes in Bengaluru's Whitefield. See you soon.